Everything in this world is what you think it is. Nothing operates the way you think it does. What do you mean? Nothing operates the way you think it does. What do you mean? Government does not work the way you think it's it does. It's not about people voting no. for a president. No, it has nothing to do with that. We're talking money. We're talking control, corporations, mm -hmm. big business, period. It's all big business and money. Period. Yeah. End of sentence. Now, uh, religion is a corporation. It's all, all the religions of the Western world, especially in the Western mm -hmm. world, all religions operate under maritime admiralty law. Mm -hmm. Uh, so there are certain... What do you mean uh, maritime admiralty law? Maritime admiralty is the law of water. And I talk a lot about this in, in the past. I'm going right. to talk a lot about it in the future. Okay. There are only two things on the earth, uh, on this earth, land and water. Right. So there are two kinds of law, the law of the land and the law of water. Mm. The law of the land is the custom of the people who live on a particular piece of land. So the law of the land is different in every country. Right. I mean, you can do things in Russia you can't do in America. Right. You can do things in South Africa you can't do in China because right. it's the law of the land. That particular piece of land has their own custom. Mm. So the custom of the people living on a particular piece of land is called the law of the land. Okay, got it. But there is also a larger, far more important law on the earth. It's called the law of the sea, the law of the water. Mm -hmm. And when you get into and in that law is referred to in courts as maritime admiralty. Maritime okay. admiralty is the law of water. Okay. Once you understand the law of water, it opens up a world what of occult is... hidden symbols and hidden... Uh, hidden foundations on how we live. What it's, are some of those laws that we're not aware? Oh of? Uh, my goodness! When you walk into a courtroom, why do you why do you go why do you go to court? You play basketball on the court. You yeah. play tennis on a court. Right. Yeah. How do you play tennis on a court? You play with a racket. Come on. <laughs> and so when the judge walks out. He he rules from the bench. Right. Look it up in a Latin dictionary. The word bench is a bank in Latin. Uh. And so, would it, and so the judge is ruling for the bank. Huh. That's why he wears a black robe, because the black robe represents the planet Saturn, the god of banking and law. Oh. The black robe represents the planet Saturn, who in the ancient world was called Lord of the Rings. Wow. Well, he is Lord of the Rings. Right, there's rings. And yeah. so women were told in the ancient world to listen to their god, so they would wear an ear ring. Men were to get married before their god, so they wear a wedding ring. Uh -huh. Because Saturn was Lord of the Rings, wow. the, and he is also the inhibitor. He was the one who holds you back. He represents government, banking, the uh -huh. police department, uh, uh, all kinds of institutions that are 